SCP-037, Object Class Euclid, Special Containment Procedures. SCP-037 is magnetically contained at Site-32. It is housed in a small subterranean room composed of heat conditioning, radiation-resistant polymer, and evacuated of any atmosphere. Heat from the object is radiated into the surrounding rock. Should the integrity of the enclosure somehow be compromised, the emergency system will generate low power Aragon plasma shield until it is repaired. The contingency of uh, access denied. Description. The artifact was discovered in 1989 above the Beaufort Sea at approximately the North Magnetic Pole. Intense electromagnetic interference was reported by Canadian Forces Station Alert, followed by an extremely bright object descending toward the ocean from the sky. A SCPS guardian responded and discovered the object wavering in an erratic trajectory about 200 meters above the surface of the water. Once containment procedures devised it, it was transported to Site-32 for study. SCP-037 is apparently a star approximately 5 centimeters in diameter with a luminosity of about 1 times 10 times that of our sun and a surface temperature of about 5,000 Kelvin. The age and origin of SCP-037 is unknown, however its nuclear activity is being carefully monitored for irregularities. Special analysis and comparison to the known celestial body suggests that it is the typical star quickly undergoing the journey just into a red giant. Though it is unknown if established theories of star formation or in aging apply, it is thought to have entered the Earth's magnetosphere via the North Magnetic Pole. Containment and transport of SCP-037 have been achieved through the use of powerful electromagnets, to which the artifact aligns itself according to its own magnetic field. The primary challenge to containment thus far has been its powerful electromagnetic emissions, which are intense enough to be easily seen by the naked eye from the high Earth orbit. Its current enclosure is located deep underground to, to prevent detection and facilitate radioactive cooling into the surrounding bedrock. In effect, the entire facility is a surrounding volume of the Earth's crust act as a massive heat sink. Over years of study, the star has undergone a shift in an emitted EM radiation, suggesting that it is undergoing stellar evolution at a vastly accelerated rate. If the standard stellar models hold up, this will soon result in an increase in radius by a factor of 100 to 300 times and a contaminant increase of radiated energy. Emergency containment contingencies are being studied for that eventually further progression of the star's cycle will likely terminate in the stellar nova, which is estimated to have a yield of blank. Exploitation predict this to occur in blank years. Research is underway for a method to arrest this development or to transport SCP to a safe distance from the plant before it occurs.